don't know about you, but I think I'm like the sleepiest person on earth, but my dog is definitely not. He wakes up at the same time every morning, which forces me to get up out of bed and let him outside. But before I do that, I like to just kickstart my morning with something really delicious to drink. And I usually grab for some fresh fruit and my little juicer because honestly, a grapefruit and an orange taste so much better to me in the morning than a cup of coffee or any caffeinated drink ever makes me feel. So I just go ahead and juice those up and then pour them into a mug. dog to let him go outside and we usually go on a little bit of a short walk and then we just head back inside to go get some breakfast. So I started off with some Yoplait strawberry yogurt and did four spoonfuls of that into my bowl. And then I also grabbed two pre-washed strawberries and just cut those up into little bite-sized pieces and then put them into my yogurt bowl. grab some frozen blueberries to add to my yogurt bowl because I love frozen blueberries that might be weird but I love them so much and then I also grab some Nature Valley crunchy granola in the flavor honey and oats and that is so delicious just to sprinkle over your yogurt I also grab a passion fruit and cut that up which is kind of like an exotic fruit I guess that maybe we don't have a lot in the States but it tastes so good and I just cut that up it's like really sweet and sour and then I just go ahead and sit down and eat my yogurt and my passion fruit and then drink the rest of my juice from that morning. And I think that this is such a great breakfast to eat because honestly it is so healthy. It makes you feel so much better than a ton of sugar or heavy foods do in the morning. get around to getting ready for the day I head to the bathroom and I like to put my hair up in a little top knot or something like that because honestly if you have long hair you know it gets in your face and it gets all wet when you're trying to wash your face so I just like to get it out of the way and just secure that with a bobby pin and then I also like to just wash my hands and brush my teeth a corner of a hand towel that I use for washing my face and then put some hot water on it and wrung it out and then just wipe that over my face to kind of get off any dirt or oils that I've had on my face from the night or from the other day. I just think that this is a great way to just kind of open up your pores before putting on your cleanser or anything like that. And then I grab my first aid beauty deep cleanser cleanser which is really great. I love it so much and it has really cleared up any of my blemishes I've had recently. And then I go ahead and just squirt a little bit of that on my hands and massage it into my face for a solid like minute to two minutes and then rinse it off. done washing and drying my face I grabbed my first aid beauty ultra repair lotion which is honestly my favorite lotion I think that I have ever used on my face I love it so much and then I just massage that into my skin and then when I'm done doing that I go ahead and head into my bedroom to do my makeup for the day because I didn't have a ton of blemishes or redness on my face I just grabbed my Amazonian clay tinted moisturizer by Tarte and just kind of put that over my cheeks where they were a little bit red and then I grabbed my Sonia Kashuk loose powder in the shade undetectable and just dusted that over my entire face for a little bit of a 
coverage over anything that might be coming through. And I just love this loose powder so much. I did grab my liquid liner to do a little bit of a wing liner look today because I did want my eyes to pop just a little bit because I wasn't going to be doing any eyeshadow or anything like that. And then I also grabbed my little sample size of the Benefit Roller Lash Mascara that they're coming out with. And honestly, I love this mascara so much and I'm definitely going to be buying the bigger size of it when it comes out. And I just put that on my top and lower lashes. Then to address my crazy hair, I took out my bobby pin and let it down. And I did curl my hair the other day, so it was still a little bit wavy and curly. So I just added some Tresemme dry shampoo and just kind of massaged that in. And the dry shampoo just absorbs any oil or grease or anything like that in your hair. So I just kind of added that in and just kind of massaged it. And then finger comb through the bottom of my hair. I also added a drop of the Bumble and Bumble hair oil into the bottom of my hair because it was looking a little bit frizzy. And this just makes it look super shiny and healthy. And I don't know about you, but I'm definitely not one to go out in my pajamas. So I went ahead and changed and then grabbed my Amazing Grace perfume by Philosophy and sprayed a little bit of that in the air and then twirled through it. Girl, you gotta twirl through your perfume. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then I went ahead and threw on my jean jacket, a tank top from Forever 21, some jeans because it was a little bit chilly, and my favorite sneakers. And I was all ready to go to meet up with my friends today. And I just think that this is a really cute and comfortable outfit, even when it's chilly. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching my morning routine. And I hope you guys all have an amazing week. And don't forget to hit like and subscribe. I'll catch you guys next time. See ya!